of problem making. Welcome guys back to my channel. Hello. Can I say that? Oh, spoken. We're gonna be cooking with Jean, Nanny Jean, and um, made me this fat for years. So she's gonna <laughs> she's gonna help fatten us all up with a recipe. Now I've bought something for a recipe and my nana's already started with her recipe. What are you doing, Jean? I'm doing cupcakes. Cupcakes. And um, quite traditional, quite plain and safe. Yes, yes. I'm doing a Maltese cheesecake. Right. Jean's already started. Let's see what have you what have you already done, Jean? Well I've mixed. Shall I bring it over? Bring it over, I wait. I've mixed this ready for a cupcake. Oh lovely. What's in this? It's like a carrot cake mix. A carrot cake? Yeah, but it's gonna be in cupcakes. So what is this? Is this carrot? <laughs> Come on. What Come on. What's this? Yes. That's a carrot cake. No, and what is that? Then it is. Carrot. It's carrot. <laughs> yes. I do it. Is it? Yes. Come on. Oh, I don't like that. It's, it's beautiful. So, how do you make that, Jean? Well, butter, flour, sugar, eggs. Do I have any um, measurements of those? Oh, yes. Right. <laughs> We'll get you the measurements, we'll put them on, don't you? We'll put that measurement So, up. I'm going to be doing um, Maltese cheesecake. So, I've got... Nice down, please. Excuse me. So, I've got the dark chocolate, milk chocolate, white chocolate, because we are not racist. No, we're not. No. I've got the... Come on, look at that one. So Jean's got the cupcake tray. Oh, it's a new one as well. Sure. Right, so how much are you going to spoon in there, Jean? Well, I'm just going to, um, I haven't measured to say how many. Okay. Probably, you put that down there for me, please. I'll put it there so the viewers can see. All right, okay. Um, so I've just thought. Right. Oh. Now, is there a technique to this? No, there's no technique. I washed my hands, you should have showed that before we started. I hope, I hope you did, because we're very health and safety conscious. Oh yes, I did. So, yeah, you've got... Got more on the... It's <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, not really a, a, a knack that I did, just no. get it in. So, if you put it down there, I might manage better, but... Well... Right, wait. Will I be able to see? No, I'll, I'll just move it. Well, Jean's going to do that. I'm going to move that down. So, have you got another bowl for me? Yes, of course. Oh, good. You love these cakes, they're beautiful. That would be too much, but... But well, that's okay. A little bit extra is fine. It's when you run out. Yes. That's, that's the problem, that's isn't it? That's truly, and yes, it is. It is. But uh, what do you think about them? Do you think there's enough in them? Or? Oh, well, I think so, because they're going to... Are they going to rise, Of Jean? course they are, yes, I hope so. Excuse me. So we're hoping for these cupcakes to rise with the unidentified bits of carrot in them. Beautiful. 150 grams of hognut biscuits, or biscuits of your choice. But I, I went for... Good old fashioned digestives. Good choice, Jean. Good choice. I always use the, if I make a cheesecake, I always use digestives. See, I've learned from the best. Yes, of course you have. Right. Excuse me. So I will be getting the bowl, but I need, I do need a push off. So in a packet of digestives, there's 316 grams. Now, I think we'll need 150. Sorry. Do you want a hammer? We want to, we want to then. That'll be fine. Do you, do you need to preheat that oven or not? It's uh, preheated, Liam. Oh, I think I've it got, is, yeah. Yeah, I've got it on. Oh, that's good. Right, these are going in the oh, oven no, now. They're going in, they're going in. These are going in the oven now. Yeah. Okay. Okay, G. Right, what temperature have you got that on, G? 
I've got it on for on uh, probably about 15 minutes, 20 minutes. 20 minutes, yes. right. I'll put the timer on. Right, thank you. So Jean's mopping down, which is a very important part of the cooking, ready for the next. Health and safety is above and uh, beyond what's oh, important. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah, I'll tell you what. <laughs> it's worse than bloody red pepper, green tomato or whatever it is. Jackie White's Market. Jackie White's Market. <laughs> so yes, all these ingredients are from Jackie White's Market. No, they're not. Yes, they are. Oh, no. Jackie they're White's Market. They're from the Market. So, a hundred. Oh, geez, would you be able to, just to get all your anger out, could you push them biscuits? Yes, I'm going to Because you know how we're doing it in a bag, don't you? Yes. Is that how you did it last time? Yes. Yeah. Is that what you want? What do you want yeah. more? Well, it said 150 grams. And how many grams is there? 360. All oh, right, that's not true, when? I want a lot more, I like that's my favourite. Well, that's my favourite part of the recipe, I think. Is it? I've got some more in if you want. Yeah. It's just put the whole thing in. Yeah, that's what I like. Yeah, so that's what I like. Yeah, 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 that's what I So as you can see from that, Jean is taking all of that hand out on the biscuits. Oh my god, we've got a split bag. Get the camera off We need to melt the butter, so we're we gonna do it in the pan, yeah? So I'm using anchor, anchor butter. But that's not butter, is what? it? Is it not? Yeah, sorry. I always use a uh, leaf pack. Yeah, but, well, I was going to get leaf pack, but I didn't know if it was actual, like, if it was butter or not. Of course it is. Right, can I have um, a knife? So we need 125, so this is 250, so we're going to just go half. Yes. Maybe it's a little bit old. Yes, because you've got a lot of biscuits. When it adds on with the biscuits. Right. Right. So Jean's going to pop that on the pan, so this is the butter to melt, is that all right like that? Yes. We're getting there, we're getting there guys. We've got the Maltesers. Yeah. Um, you so, want, um, so you just, me once the butter is melted, we add the biscuit and then we'll add some Maltesers. And that's our base. So while that butter's melting... Have that ice and sugar in here. I'll have you. Mm -hmm. We've got the che cream cheese. Now, because it's Christmas, when I went to get the Philadelphia, we didn't, we didn't have any. So I had to get this. It's some in the fridge. Is it? This is, I can't believe I'm not Philadelphia. We've got 400 grams, so that's exactly right. This, I can't believe I'm not Philadelphia. Right. So I'm mixing these with the ice and sugar. Oh, it's a bit messy this, isn't it? It's hard business being a cook. Right, so we're on to the next phase. So this is our crushed biscuit. Can you come in there, Jean? Oh, sorry. So yeah. can you let us know how you, you got this biscuit crushed? Well, I just crushed them in the bag, just... With? With the... With the... <laughs> Excellent. And just broke them. Broke yeah. them down, that's yeah. brilliant. And what we've got, we've got, we've got the melted butter that is in the pan. So we're going to add the biscuits to the melted butter, get a, re a really nice consistency, and then we're going to put it in a, a baking tin. Would or, you like the... Or how, what, do we put it on a plate? What do we No, you put it in a tin. A tin. So we're going to put it in a tin. So while Jean's mixing this with the butter, um, I'm going to make the topping which is the light soft cheese, creme fraiche, and icing sugar. Very nice. That looks amazing. This is going in to the bowl. Your cupcakes all right, don't open the thing. That's a, a, a bit of a tip from us. Don't open the oven door. Okay. Otherwise, your cupcakes might go soggy. Right. And no one likes a soggy cupcake. Oh no, certainly not. How are you getting on? I'm fine, Ian. Ooh. 
Tony is. What? Tony is. It's messy, isn't it? Hard work, this. Very hard work. It is very hard work. I hope people appreciate it. I don't know how people do it every day. Well, it's like living, Liam. They've trained for years to do things like this, you know. I just mean cooking in general. Alright. Well, that's, that's their living and they like doing Ooh, it. Oh, this so going in now is the creme fraiche. Jean creme fraiche. Why is it going in now? Creme fraiche again from the good old local co-op. Put it all in then. What? Put it all in. It didn't say put it all in. How did it not? Because last year we did a marble cake, didn't we? Yes. So, are oh, we going to put chocolate in that mix or are we just going to use it for the top? Just leave it for the top. Yeah, it's up to you, Liam. I think put a bit in because I don't like it plain. Well, like put some in. If it doesn't taste like chocolate, I think I can taste it. Well, you have cheese. to melt the chocolate a little bit, so Yeah, we'll have to melt that a bit. You, will, you don't like dark chocolate very much, I do don't you? mind. Because we've got white chocolate for the top. Oh, lovely. And we've got milk chocolate for the in. Yeah. It's like a vice versa. Yeah. yeah. Can you remember a vice versa? Oh, do you know who when Dr. Oker is? Well, he's, he's a very, um, yes. I don't know if he's French or he's French. I think he's a friend of um, uh, Mr. Dormio. Oh, is he? Oh, yes. Yes, probably. Who else? So I'm breaking the milk chocolate up in the smaller pieces. Just really for our benefit so we're not standing here for ages waiting for it to melt. Some people do this in the microwave, some people do it on the pot. Preference, I find if, if it's done in the microwave you've got to be very careful because if it's done that little bit too much then that you've had it. I agree with you. Yeah. I agree. Plus, back in Jean's day in 1910, they didn't have microwaves did they? No. No, they put it in front of the fire. Yes, yeah, we did. Or they put it, someone was in the tin bath and they would hold the chocolate in a bowl and the steam would melt it. No, you put in a little pan on the gas. You put your little bowl on, on that the gas. <laughs> I think we did. You did not have gas. The gas man used to come and light their lights in the street. You tell me you had the chocolate on the lights. <laughs> You put it in the pan and you put uh, your bowl on the top and the heat off the boiling water yeah. melts your chocolate. From the bath. <laughs> Excuse me. So we're gonna, get it, we're gonna get a tin for, now, tin for the bath. Sorry, not the bath. <laughs> for, we're getting a tin for the biscuit. So we've got our baking tin for the cheesecake but this is a non-bake um, recipe so you don't have to put this in the oven. But what's good about these tins I think is that you just release your cheesecake on there and the cheesecake's on there so all your guests think wow how have you got that out of the bowl yes don't they true yes it really is a now I've... now we didn't have these in the oven days but I've got no. it there. what did you use I think did you use an old slipper no the the bottom of an old slipper. I'll slip it here in a minute. What did you use? Oh, really? Um, this, did... this is thingy and this is getting hot. Oh, of course. We're there. We're there. Right. So we're transferring now to the thing. So would you like to bring that over, Jean? Yes, I will do. I'm going to put this into the base, into the tin. Wait one moment and I'll get rid of my spoon. Right, that's... Just to let it on off. Oh. Is that okay? That is perfect, Jean. Just oh, that's a good idea. Yeah. See, in the olden days, you did do a lot of it at home cooking. They don't do it now, Liam, do they? No, because you've got, you've got ready meals now. I know, but it's, it's not as nice as when you made them all yourself. Well, I haven't melted in a pan, if that's all right. So I'm just breaking it up into small chunks. So while that chocolate's melting, we're going to get the cupcakes. We're going to check the cupcakes if they're ready. And um, the carrot cupcakes. Oh. They're not ready yet, Liam. Oh, they're not ready. Oh. 
Are you on there, honey? Yep. This is the cupcakes. Oh, wait, we'll just want another two minutes. We're not sure what happened to the one on the end. What's <laughs> <laughs> He's having a bit of it. Another couple of minutes. Another couple of minutes just to brown them off, I think. Yes. So we've done the chocolate and the it will mix. So we're going to make it like a bit of a marble effect. Mm -hmm. Oh no, get it all in, Jean. Right, can I use that the thing? Mm -hmm. Wooden spatula is better for this sort of thing because it doesn't stick as much, isn't that right? Yes. So I'm mixing that with the cream cheese and the butter. Now we need a bit of icing sugar. So do we put the icing sugar in it as well? Yes. Maybe, maybe should have put it in before this. Oh well. Shall I just put a little bit in? Because we don't really stick to recipes. No. We kind of, you in know. In the olden days we didn't have that In recipes. the olden days we didn't have paper. No. You have it, you knew it in your head. You have it right it on the wall. Oh. A finished product. My not finished product, you know. Is that enough? Is that? No. More? No. No. No, a bit more. A bit more. A little bit more. A little bit more. This is icing sugar, we'll put it into the... A little bit more. You can see the marble effect. Then what do we do with this? Just wait. We'll just wait with this, yes. So we wait until the biscuit has cooled down. Otherwise, this is the tip. If you don't wait long enough for this, then when you put your cream cheese, etc, etc, it'll just slide off because it'll be, it'll get warm. Okay? You're welcome. <laughs> Transferring onto a tree. So we've got the cupcakes out the oven, we've got the biscuit in the tin. What we're doing now, Jean? We're going to have a short break now. If you come back in, in four minutes, four five minutes. And by that time it'll have cooled down. Yes, yes, yes. So we'll see you in a minute. It's exciting stuff. Yes, it is. Um, can anyone read me now the penny, by the way? Exactly, that's what we are now, so <laughs> see you soon. See you later. We've let this cool down. We've let these cool down. These are Jean's cupcakes. Well, this is, I'm just putting it into there. Yeah. Then we'll smooth it off. Yeah. And we'll get it all in. Right. So I'm just spreading out. Tell you what she's going to be putting on top of the cupcakes. Oh, Betty Crocker. Oh, she gets everywhere, that Betty Crocker. She's worse than friggin' Bessie. How? So this is indulgent chocolate icing. You beat this up, Liam. You beat it. Beat it! Just beat it! <laughs> well, I'm not gonna lie, it doesn't look very appetising at the minute. Well, well, <laughs> For the Maltesers. Yes. So, a, a tip here, don't worry about, just... <laughs> just get a handful of chocolate on it! Look at that! Beautiful! Looks like so much piles! <laughs> Come on and stop being... I think I'm going to win! I think I will actually! You push it down a bit like that, uh -huh. and then you put yeah. it on top of your cake! Somehow! <laughs> Oh, look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Wow. Wow. Look at these cupcakes. Watch out, Mary Berry. I like it how you're doing everyone different. I like it how you're standing in front of the camera. Oh, sorry. There we are. Sorry. Just open it up a bit, please. Would you like to do some? Leo? I wouldn't. And these are called the diabetes cake. <laughs> no. On a serious note, these are Christmas, you know, inspired. I've got the milk, white milk chocolate for snow. I'm not just saying this, but you wouldn't get better at Greg's. Oh! Oh, I've got sprinkles. Yes, thank you, Liam. 
Molly. Now, what you should do, wait for Roland, your hands are dry, so just get a bit like that and sprinkle it on like Come that. Come round, Jean. Oh, sorry. Um, we can't see you there. Sorry. So, oh my goodness, this is amazing. This is amazing, isn't it? Don't put in your mind, though. Why? Because I want just... Eh? I, I don't want this. This is not going on the morn. That's How, not going on the morn. powdery stuff. No, don't put any morn. Right. Dropped it. Your hands. No, I'm there. <laughs> You've spilled it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Now, people, what do we feel about Now we're going to have turkey disco. <laughs> <laughs> it's going oh, to do it again. Oh, sorry. <laughs> oh, my God. Now, now, doesn't that just... Isn't that amazing? Doesn't it just say Christmas? Let us know who's won. There you go, guys. This is the end product. What do you think? Please, please. Would anyone like to taste one? <laughs> there we are. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Thanks for watching. See you later. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, everyone. Bye. Thanks. Thank you for watching us. Bye-bye. <laughs>